Nothing is worse than a cold morning and a shower that won't get hot. Abacus Plumbing's John Cantu shows how the Grunfoss recirculating pump can be easily and quickly installed, providing hot water when and where you need it most. Well, we run into a lot of customers, they're having problems with not getting enough instant hot water to certain fixtures. We can actually, actually mount a Grunfoss pump on a water heater and get instant hot water to the furthest fixture. The water is shut off to the heater and the hot water side drained. Then the hot water outlet is cut. I'm disconnecting on the hot side and this is actually where we go and put in the Grunfoss pump. And I actually put a special fitting we call a brass mill adapter on this side. So one good thing about this Grunfoss pump, you can actually set it several times. You don't have to have this pump on all the time. And I always tell everybody, always set it about 30 minutes before you take that first shower. All right, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down to the uh, kitchen. Now the first thing you want to do, you want to turn off the hot cold water. You're disconnecting your supply lines to your faucet. This is actually your thermal bypass valve that we actually will mount underneath your sink. The actual incoming water will go in from the cold side and we have in incoming water on the outside. The braided hoses come with a kit and attach first to the bypass valve, then to the hot and cold outlets and finally to the faucet. I connected the uh, hot side that's the supply and the hot and cold side supply, and I connect it to the thermal bypass valve. Okay, then it came off the bypass valve and connected it from your supply going to your kitchen faucet on your hot and cold. And of course, I su support it I, uh, on this back wall here. Now, uh, the, yeah, the customer has experienced about three to four minutes of getting hot water to this fixture here in the kitchen. Okay, uh, we pretty much uh, took care of the gruffness pump up in there from the water heater, and we installed the thermal bypass valve underneath the kitchen sink. There you go. Nice, nice hot water. Being able to retrofit an existing gas or electric hot water system is a big money saver. Having hot water when you want it is outstanding. For Home Show Radio, I'm Tom Tynan.